What's up, friends? Welcome back to I Eat a Foodie. Today we are trying out green mango and Rancho Cuca mangoes, Ooh. and uh, <laughs> it's it's Thai food. Yeah, I've never had Thai food. Never. Be fire. You had Thai food? Yeah. Yeah, Rex recommended it to us. I've, I've, I've tried pad thai. I'm not gonna lie, I've tried pad thai. But I mean, I'm gonna try some different shit today. So like he said, it's in Rancho Cuca Mango, where the Rancho Cuca Mango killers at, guys. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so now let's go check it out. It's gonna be Yo, what's up, guys? What's up, what's up guys? friends? We're, we're finally sitting down here at Green Mango. We got a few things. We got some Thai tea. I got some kryptonite, which you gotta mix. And we got a special guest. Aaron. 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 Let's Aaron. go, baby. Aaron from IE and Friends. Thank Aaron you. from my the, my long, long lost cousin. <laughs> Thank you for <laughs> now. We got me. we also got a Singha beer as well as I said. Yeah, right? Singha. It's a Thai beer. So. Thai beer. Yeah, I'm ready. To, I'm excited to check I got it. an owner Palmer. Right now, we're also waiting for our food, obviously. So this is chai tea? Yeah, let me try yeah, this. You want to try it? Uh, it's first let, me, time. let me take a little sip. It's fire, bro. I think it's fire. I've had regular tea. like the. Interesting. It's, uh, <laughs> I, you didn't like it. <laughs> I didn't, didn't, say, like, I didn't it. like it. Uh, it tastes like uh, melted ice cream. Huh? I've had it at one spot. I kind of didn't really care for it, but can I try it? Yeah. I want to see how it's different here. That's like a different milk. Uh, like a uh, different team milk. You gotta shake it more. I need to shake it more. You think this is leche? De oh, this is way better than that one spot I had at one it's time. Sweet, huh? You think it's leche de chichi or not? Nah. <laughs> if it is, I want some more. I want some of that chichi milk. Whoa! What do you think Yo, you're thinking? You think you're this shit, bartender? Yeah. That shit's fire, bro. <laughs> As that we have it. It's pretty good. As that's good. We have it. I like it. I'm, um, I'm gonna have to get Thai iced tea from here now. All right, guys. Let me try the. So you got you guys both of you guys. Oh got, yeah, we got chai beer. Uh huh. Have you tried Sprite? Thai beer, I mean. <laughs> like, it's Thai, it's this Thai is, Sprite. This is how you pour beer like a man. There you go. The whole Dang, bottle. You filled it up all the way. A wee wee? A wee wee? You said it tastes like Modelo. Yeah, it tastes like Modelo. Like, bro. Yeah, it's, it's, it's like Modelo. Yeah, like it's like Modelo. Not close, but it's a it's a decent beer. This yeah. is actually. It's like, it, I don't know if it's me. Maybe, like, maybe it's the tea, but I can taste like some, like a fruit. I can, um, I taste the, uh, the hops. Has a lot of hops. A lot of hops. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, th th this Thai beer has been over the um, the border for sure. Oh, it's from Bangkok. That's some party yeah, shit. Yeah, right I there. just I, I said that one earlier. No, no it's a good dog. beer. It's not strong at all. This beer is not strong nah. at all. I'm there's like, like no there's like no kick, but it's good. I feel like you're gonna put that in on it. Huh? <laughs> yeah, it's fine. It's just flat. It's just good. It's good. Cause you guys like that Mexican beer, huh? Like that that fucking gassy. Uh, Mexican beer, I only like. Um, Dos X, Estrella Jalisco, and Pacifico. Only. The three main ones. The three main ones. But you're you know alcoholic. What? You know what? I don't, I don't drink uh, Dos X anymore, bro. Estrella Jalisco is fire. Yeah, yeah. I was just like, with hey, the nice little lemon go. or lime. Name three Mexican beers right now. Right now, go. But I, look, look, I've, I've been drinking a lot of uh, Blue Moon. Blue Moon. But no, I agree um, with you on the Mexican ones. That's what I like too. I love yeah. Dos X, Pacifico, and Estrella Jalisco. Fire, yeah, bro. fire, bro. Have you had Estrella Jalisco? Yeah. That's, yeah. Fire. Like when you go to Mexico, I mean, when you go to Mexico, it depends what part, but they usually just put Everything's like, better in Mexico, bro. They the Sprite and Coke is way better oh, in Mexico. Course. The women. Nope. What do we have here? Oh, there Tonka you go. Uh, what is it called? Tomka. Tomka soup. It got medium with chicken. I fucking love soup, bro. I don't care. I'm a yeah, every time he comes to my house, my mom's making Carlos de Pollo or Carlos de Res. He's like, yeah, you don't invite me? Yeah, <laughs> y'all be eating soup, soup like in the like in the hot, like when it's hot? Yeah, yeah. my mom be making uh, some nah. soup. That's when it hits good, fuck. Nah. Uh, <laughs> you're sweaty. sweaty. You're getting my your... mom don't make it when it's cold. She makes it when it's hot, bro. I don't get it, bro. No. I be sweating. My I mom really makes sopa, I be sweating. Nah, like, there's I been a lot of times in the summer I've been eating Carlos too, but I was like, your Why? <laughs> your sweat hits the, the caldo and it gives more flavor, huh? They couldn't think like, hey, let's like, damn, it needs a little salt. How about, like, yeah, maybe, a little salt. Right. Like, how about yeah. maybe like a ceviche or something, you know, something yeah. like cool Some for the cold. summer. Nah, I, know you guys don't, I know you guys don't want soup, but try it. Uh, okay, okay, okay. That's fair enough, fair enough. Just, just like that. Fair enough, fair enough. We are here to try, but I just don't want soup because it's hot. Is it hot? I mean, it's not hot, hot outside. It's kind of like cool, but whatever. Oh, it's really good. Fire, bro. Yeah. It's That's mild. Bomb. It's not that spicy. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, this is the oh, papaya okay. salad. The green one. Ooh. Right. Fried rice? Fried rice. Oh, oh, that's your fried rice right there, sir. Hey. We'll get some more. Man, pepper. good today. I've heard good things about that one, so. Papaya salad. Yo, that it. was really good. Let me get some more. You want? I mean, you can get some, bro. Yo, that, that was actually very. I, that's, I, that's, that's, that's salt. That soup juice is really good. That's how one eats. I like how this looks. What is it? Tomato? Yeah. Probably, I think it is. Eat this right here. That's just fine. That's the papaya, but it's, you gotta it's better with it has, the pork, it has yeah. lemon and all this shit. 
I'm grabbing my fingers. Did you just blow? I'm gonna punch Did you just blow on something gold? <laughs> <laughs> I'll have the count. Hold on, let me, let me, I wanna try it. Let me fucking just try it. No, that's a good, I like the texture. Oh, oh my god. god. That's good. Yeah, that's really good. Like Shout out to Worth It, thank you. Started with the first questions on the table. I was about to say, I already, 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 already asked that. That's first question. What y'all think about that Kanye and Kanye? Oh, never mind. I thought you were talking about pineapple on pizza. Um, I think it's embarrassing. I think, look, I think it's embarrassing for Kanye, bro. Like, like, bro, okay, look, I understand he's going through shit. His mom died. I, I, don't, I don't know what that His mom like. died a long, long time ago. Bro. I know, but like yeah. some, some people heal from that. Some people don't, which I get. Yeah. But the thing is, bro, you're old, bro. Why are you still acting like that, my boy? Man's like 40. Yeah. But also Kim, they they're treating her like she's a saint. She's did so many fucked up shit. Yeah. The whole Kardashian. She's not a saint, bro. They 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 did nothing but black foods and they fucked them over. Every guy they dated. Every day they, the guy, they, they every guy they dated, they become crazy. They don't fuck them over purposely. No, but they like, get fucked I, over because they joined the reality TV the reality well, I, TV. I, life. I feel like I feel like it's, it's a curse. Family, At this it's point, it's a curse, it's a bro. curse. Like that, like the, through like a Madden curse. It's like, like fool, it's a but curse. But you think you think they do it on purpose? Like, oh, I'm a fuck him because I'm a I'm a curse his whole life. Probably, you never Maybe, know. Maybe, I don't know. Bitches are crazy, fool. I mean, they're billionaires. But yeah. this, this is my thing. Look, uh, you know, you know, what's the most fucked up shit. What? Maybe like they don't want it to happen, but you know who really loves all this happening? Their mom. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. She yeah. loves that all this is going on. She mm. loves the it. The devil works hard, but Chris works hard. Ah. <laughs> so they were mad that Kanye West was making a bunch of shit public. But then it came out to it came out because uh, they're doing a whole new season. They're all doing a whole yeah. new series. And that's, yeah. it's, it's that's, all they, that's the only reason why they got mad. Yeah. Yeah. They love that this is going on. They love it. That's they love the drama. Up. But they just got mad because he leaked all this shit before their show came out. It's a little fucked yeah. up. I was explaining like, I'm only scared, bro. Like if he commits suicide one day. Yeah. He will. He's, like he's way too. He's way too popular. Bro, way too even, rich. even his own team said that they're scared that yeah. in a few years he yeah. might. Come I get you. I get you. If, they, if he keeps going down the same down down that road, yeah, I get you. Yeah, yeah. Bro, if he's, they, been, he's been doing this shit since like what 2015. When did it all start? 2014. No, but he was. No, but no, no. But the thing is, though, like he, he wasn't going crazy. He was. He was. He was. In a, he was in a relationship. He was good with his wife or whatever. Of course, they have up and downs. So but like look, other but, but this is what I understand. This is what I mean, like about like pe- girls try to girls try to praise Kardashian, <laughs> like if nothing's wrong with her. She's on her fourth divorce, bro. Like well, something's yeah. obviously wrong with her. If you are, try- if you're, <laughs> no, it's like no one's yeah, trying to protect Kanye. No one should be protecting Kim either. Cause exactly. I'm saying if, right you're, if you're if you're mainly a if, girl, if you're a woman or a girl, you're trying to protect Kim's actions, bro. It's like. I mean, but yeah, but I'm saying if he loses his kids, that man's gonna fucking be down bad. Yeah, yeah he shouldn't be. He shouldn't lose his kids. Bro. I don't he think. I don't think shit. she should make him. I think maybe he should go to rehab, focus on himself. But she shouldn't take the kids like that. Bro. We have for what? What is he addicted to? I don't know. Whatever. It's it's fucking going on with him. I mean, when he has. What do you surgery? mean she shouldn't take the kids? No, no, no. I mean, okay. Yeah, like that one came out. Because are you gonna keep him with Kanye? No, no, no. Thank you. Thank you. I feel like she. She obviously she should keep the ki- kids, and then once he's better, then you know. Shout out to Pete yeah. for actually finally. Bro, oh, that shout out, yeah, shout, shout out, my boy Pete. That shit was fucking funny. He yeah, was like, funny. I'm, "It's funny." He's like, I'm, "I'm in bed with your wife," and, yeah. and then he's like, "But I actually seek some mental help." That was low key fucked up. That was funny. That's some shit I would. And do. the photo he took, yeah. bro. You saw that he he got her name tatted on him. Oh, that's, oh, that's idiot. Crazy, bro. Idiot. Right here, like, oh, what is it? Yeah, on the right side, right here. So Pete Davidson has a idiot. He has a he has a history of doing that. Pete, mm-hmm. I'm gonna tell you right now, my boy. I don't think he's listening. No, he already right. did it, bro. Pete. If you're watching this, bro, don't <laughs> let us down, please, bro. Like, if Pete has time, bro, this is the thing, fool. Like, look, if I'm famous or rich or whatever, and one of the Kardashians get at me or whatever, dude, I'm just gonna f- smash and leave. Dude, he These already don't did think that. Like, they don't think like that, With bro. Ariana Grande. Yeah, what already he, got the But that's Ariana buddy. Grande. But what if he actually Kardashian? loves them? Like, yeah. Yeah. Y'all forget what about love. Getting, the chicken and the You guys uh, can have rice. some, by the way. I'm just eating this, like, it's really good. This sauce on is fire. What is that? Crying tiger. I want to try it. Try it. Grab a piece, my boy. Hey, so I want to try it. <laughs> I never <laughs> said you guys couldn't. <laughs> you hogging it, huh? Because Aaron like growls at me when I take his food. I never do. <laughs> you just never ask. Shit, damn, this shit looks fucking fire. I'm not gonna lie. Sheesh. Damn. Sheesh. So who's paying for all of this? Larry. Larry. And that's what we brought him, bro. <laughs> Fuck you, I'm a guest. That's why we brought him. You're a guest. I'm a guest. Homie. Right here, I am foodie. We make all of our guests pay. No, no. Do your little car trick. I don't bullshit. know, but Aaron was asking for tortillas earlier. Ah, <laughs> uh, psych. Bro, have you seen the Bad Bunny with Safari issue right now? Well, okay, what's going on? Because I know. That guy is beefing, bro. Oh no, no. So 
No, the other thing, Safari Hour is that. The What's Safari Hour. Oh, you want to explain? explain? I'll, I'll explain. explain. So, look. I was a big fan. Right? Yeah. Let's go, baby. So, okay, so you guys know the song Safari Hour, right? Yeah, the yeah. concert and shit. Hold on, so I was blocking my face. I don't like that. <laughs> I'll wait. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, that's the only issue we're going to have. Fuck. Nah. So, you guys know the song Safari Hour, right? Yeah, of course. Yeah. So, you know, you know Bad Bunny got sued for that song, right? Oh, sure, you know. Fuck? So, Why? And that, and, uh, so, he got sued by that song by Missy Elliott. Because in that in the Safarea song, there's a part that goes dun, 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 Oh wow. For that one little sample. So in the and Missy Ellis song is the dun, 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 get your freak on, right? Yeah. So she sued Bad Bunny for everything. Literally, Bad Bunny, Joel, and Randy got one percent, and Missy Ellis stayed with ninety nine percent. Fuck you, Missy Ellis. What the hell, bro? And it's fucked up because that that one percent that Joel got and and Randy and Bad Bunny that they, they made like twenty thousand dollars from that whole song. That whole song is Missy Elliott's now. So I'm talking about this this Missy Elliott, she's making like millions of dollars off that song. It's no longer Bad Bunny song anymore. That's what Joel said that she don't even go on tour because she's making fucking money out of Bad Bunny. Yeah. And he's Joel is Joel is mad because, like he said, he's mad because somebody went to Missy Elliott and told her, hey look, they're using the beat. Fucking sue them, get the money. Like get your get your bag. But like he says, Missy Elliott doesn't show love to the urbano Latino like music reggaeton mm-hmm. and all that. Like she's she don't some really people, care. It's sad. Some people only show their own. They only show um, um, what do you call it? Um, support for their own um, yeah. cult, like community, music. their own yeah. community, their own shit. genre, yeah, their own genre. That's crazy. But bro. it sucks, bro. It's like, dude, at this point, who the fuck hasn't sued Drake? Why Drake samples the f- every song he's ever well, made. He, well, he clears them. He's got that money. He does. Yeah, that's the thing. Bad Bunny didn't clear. Uh, he didn't. He didn't do anything for this oh part. But god. still, like, bro, it was like three set. Oh my god. Are bro. you really that broke? And that she song, is that broke, bro. No, no, I'm talking about Missy Elliott. You really? Yeah, that she's broke? that broke. That song went that, number yeah, one. That's some petty shit, bro. It went number it's one not on actually Spotify. Like, it's the number one song on the tour. Oh, everything. And Apple Music too. It went back to number one. For me, it's like one of his latest. It's part of his latest song. Yeah, it's like at the club. Bad, yeah. Yeah. For sure. I need a, I need a tenedor. No, but that was fucked I up got you on team, bro. I'm not lying. Oh, thanks, bro. Uh-huh. No, yeah, I, I think, I mean, people will say, oh, that's his fault for not clearing it. I mean, well, you guys, are, you guys yeah. are right. I guess it's his fault and his team's fault for not clearing that. It's like, um, yeah. spring, uh, spring beans. What's that? Uh, it's like, I don't know. It's, it's like, like, like little crumbs. It's like sweet crumbs. It's like chorizo. <laughs> hey, that's the, <laughs> this is like, oh, yeah, so I guess people will say, oh, that's his fault. Right. And it's his fault for not clearing it. I get you, but also, bro, three, like, it's like a three second snippet. Have you guys ever, uh, have you ever got, hold on, let me repeat that. Have you guys ever been, um, oh my God, I can't even talk today, huh? <laughs> <laughs> have you, guys, have you ever had a, have you ever had a dream? Ever, have you ever had a dream that, 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 um, that you um, was, and then you, and, and then, then you, um, and then you did that, and then, and then he did, and then he said, but like, he did that. <laughs> <laughs> no, have you guys ever been uncomfortable by a woman? Like, by a girl? Has a girl made, a girl you, made you uncomfortable? Yeah. Like, in what way? There's like different anything. ways. Cause look, I remember I work, bro, my whole job. There was some lady, bro. I swear to God. Now I know how women feel when men feel that make them feel uncomfortable. Yeah, yeah. There was some lady that would harass me every day, bro. Every day, like she'd be like, "Hola, hola, corazón, cómo estás?" And she would hug me and she'd go like, like my lower back. And I'm like, "Damn, bro, like stop." You know, but I was like, "Damn, now I know how women feel." But then in my head, I'm like, "Well, cause she was." She was ugly. If it should have been a bad lady, I would have been like, what's up? Ah, uh, so, uh, so the double standards and the double standards. Yep. The double standards. It happens. But I'm talking about like that. Have you ever been like, have you ever felt uncomfortable? It's different now. I, that's what I was asking. You mean like sexually or like, you know, just awkwardly? Well, no, sexually. Sexually? Sexually. I've been like, honestly, like, I remember at my, one of my old jobs when I was 18, I would honestly feel really uncomfortable around, uh, we had a like, you know, people jump, some jobs have leads and shit. Yeah. Uh, we had a, a lead who, we had two leads that were gay, but one of them was really cool to me, and the other one, cool to me too, but he was a little too friendly, let's say. And, I, and when I mean too friendly, I'm just being nice with that. He literally wanted to like fucking fuck me. Mm. Like he'll breathe on your neck type shit? Like, no, he would try to touch me on, like, on, purpose, like, on my lower back and all this yeah. shit. I'd be like, hey, bro, like, honestly, like, I'm cool with you, but stop, my dude, like, nah, like. Yeah, he was There's a story though. He would have done that on the streets. Uh, it's hands right away. It's hands. But I'm in my job, and honestly, you can't do shit because he's a lead. Sexual harassment in the workplace. No, not even. No, not even that. It's just I don't. I'm not actually not even trying to get anyone fired, or I'm not even trying to fight at a job. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to get my job, bro. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But and everyone was scared to clock out. 
He's gonna be at the door waiting for him. <laughs> he was scared to go to the restroom, huh? Also, I was always scared that like people would think I was like homophobic or something, you know? Like just because I was like saying like, oh, like he, like and they be like, oh, you're just homophobic. It's like, no. It's but people always try to get you with that, bro. It's like, it's like people was, people say, oh, you can have an opinion, but when you have an opinion, they you're get wrong. mad. Yeah, you're wrong. So it's wrong. like, what the fuck do I do? It's just like, don't talk at all. That's what opinions are. They're not wrong or right. They're opinions. I was once. There's a- facts and then there's opinions. Wow. I was once accused of being homophobic because I didn't let a gay guy, like, have his way with me. For real? What the fuck? You know what I'm talking about. Oh, I know exactly what you're talking about. Oh! I already know what you're talking about. Everyone knows what you're talking about. Rex was even there, he knows what you're talking about. Not you guys, but... I've been grabbed by... (laughs) I've been grabbed, bro. Yeah? So I was at a club. A gay club? in Las Vegas with my girl. A gay club? No, no, no. It was encore. It was like a night swim thing. So we're over here dancing. It was gay night. I'm over... (laughs) So over here dancing, we're chilling, and then this big fool, this fool's probably like 6'5", this fool grabs me from the back, bro. Like if I was a girl, and he and, and I fucking hit him, fool, boom! And this fool's like, oh shit, my bad, bro, and I fuck, I got pissed, bro. You're like, I got me mad when you were saying that, bro. Yeah. Like, he was probably like, like, I thought you were my little toy. I got you wanted to stab uh-huh. him. Yeah. With a, yeah. with, a, with a butter knife, huh? With a butter knife. Oh, snap. Oh, whoa. Yeah, that's that chicken. Really good. Go. Oh, my God. Right there. Is that fit there? Yeah. yeah. God damn. Damn, Rex. What is that, what is that right here? Like salsa? That's a sweet sauce. Like, like, kind of like a sweet and sour sauce. Same oh, okay. Way. It's a little, a little spicy. Very, very okay. Nice. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank sir. You. Thank, you, thank, thank you. you. Appreciate it. My bad, love. Can I get a chicken? Yeah. No me vas a pegar? I stab you with the fork. <laughs> ah. Yeah, go ahead. Psych! Mm-hmm. You guys want rice? No. You, want you, guys want, you guys want some fried rice? Why? What's wrong? What's wrong with, what's wrong with my rice? Get out of here. <laughs> All the TikToks are gonna be noodle grabs. That's fucking bomb right there. You wanna hit him with a question or what? Hit me with a crazy question. I can answer that shit right away. Aaron, what's how up? many girls have you gotten after the podcast? Zero. Shut up. That's a lie. Zero. Why? Facts. Zero. He doesn't want to get caught up. He doesn't with who? People. With who? Call with who? I remember he told me the other day, like, yeah, bro, I'm gonna, yeah, bro, I'm fucking some bitch right now. Bro. They never <laughs> even said that. That's such I, a bullshit ride. Right. He told me the other day, I was in the back seat with bro. my shirt off. Uh, huh? Yeah, no, I forgot to turn on the AC. So you guys are fucking assholes. This is all bullshit. <laughs> you be falling asleep on Facetime, huh? Oh my god, bro. You're that no. guy, huh? No. No, you right now. No, you. No, you. Aaron's the biggest dog got out of out of us. That's a bull. Yeah. Oh my god. I your girl. I your girl. I hold her tight. Mm. He pretends. Tight, he pretends like he's no hold, but I'm telling you, my boy. He's he's playing chess. He's blushing right yeah, now. He's <laughs> Rico, Rico I'm getting red because you guys are assholes. You guys are making up all these lies. You guys are bull. You guys are <laughs> no fucking lies, assholes. And then those girls are going to text him. So who are those girls you're talking about? Nobody. <laughs> like you miss cuddles at night type shit. I do, bro. Because everybody's, I would say everybody's meant to be with somebody. Bro. Someone is meant, someone is meant to be somebody. Maybe something doesn't work, so who knows? I don't know. Just let's, just say, let's, just say, let's just say, are you looking right let's now? just say something's probably cooking up right now. Ooh, see, that's what I was talking Maybe. about. That's what I was talking Maybe. about. So you that's think right? your girl has a day right now where you're over here eating with us? Like your future <laughs> girlfriend. Damn. Bro, I thought about that. You never think about that one. Where's huh? your girl? Oh, oh, where's your wife, wife, bro? Where's your wife? She's watching. Hey, what's up? You, uh, are you sure? Uh, where's your mom? <laughs> what's wrong? <laughs> in Mexico? <laughs> in Mexico? Oh, yeah. I have a question. Go for it. You saving that noodle for later or what? What's <laughs> <laughs> <So>, huh? up? <laughs> you saving that shit for later for a little check? Uh, you want to tell me right, right now or what? You got to If the podcast dies out, what do you even do? Kill myself. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Damn. Y'all, Damn, make sure, bro, fucking... y'all make sure y'all like, comment, God. subscribe, share, and shit. <laughs> <laughs> He's driving his car to the view, huh? It just takes off. God, I was gonna Damn. ask you that before the podcast. What, what was your, what, what, what did you have in mind of doing with your Only life? Fans? Um, <laughs> I think I was thinking about you know running a um, drug smuggling trade. Okay, that's a good one. Yeah, that's, that's where the money's at. <laughs> Definitely. No, honestly, I, I had, I was just a young kid. I just didn't have, like, I mean. No plan yet? I hadn't had a plan yet, honestly, no. That's that's honestly true, I didn't have a plan yet. I've always wanted to have a job and be a coach, and that's honestly happening soon. Oh, okay. Yeah, I just, today when we're coming, I got called uh, by a company to uh, become a coach. That's sick. I don't see you as a coach. What's wrong? Yeah, I have What's another wrong? question for Hans. Right. Oh, there it is. What the fuck you doing with your life, bro? Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> It's hard right now. I know, Hans. What the damn. fuck, God? God damn, that's an attack on this that's movie. Nah, bro, listen. Eric, I mean, Hans was like one of the best actors like, I got new. 
And this motherfucker just dropped everything because he had a girlfriend. I don't know. He was one of the best actors you knew until I came around. It's because he had a kid in TJ. I was kidding. Uh, no, we don't talk about that. We don't talk about that. Not bad. Not bad. There's like three out there, bro. Nah, honestly, bro. I'm mad enough to say that. Yeah, I did fuck up because I had a relationship and I just dropped everything completely. You're those. You're those types, huh? Yeah, but now I'm in a position Damn, now in my life where oh. <laughs> I'm in a position in my life now where you know we've created this you know this little team. platform thing. So I feel like now, I, like I want to start doing it. Again. <laughs> yeah, you know, I'm definitely gonna start doing it again. Cause I feel more like now more than ever, I feel more motivated. Bro. <laughs> I'm sorry. not like thank God, like. Sorry. I'm sorry. Like I got you. Like, so, I'm sorry. You were being so serious, and then this fucker coming over and grabs a noodle, is like, damn, there's beef in this hoe. <laughs> I'm always sharing my feelings. All right. Okay. Yeah, I'm all about to cry and shit. I'm looking at his eyes. I'm not gonna lie. I think I do have ADHD. Yeah. And not on, I'm not on some like, like oh, I'm not like hyperactive. Plus. Yeah, no, 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 it's just that I get distracted very easily. Is that HDHD? That's how, that's yeah. how I was in high school. And I can't pay attention in when class, bro. With some booty. Anything would crash my attention. I'd be like trying to listen, and then I hear a conversation. I wouldn't even try to be like. I just hear something. And yeah. I'm like, no, bro. If I'm having a conversation with someone, I try so hard to focus on them. That now I'm focusing on myself, focusing on them. Oh my god, I so, thought I was the only one. So like I'm not even paying attention to them. I'm just telling myself focus. Okay, now nod. Pretend like not pretending, but like I'm fo- I'm telling myself to focus. Bro, I thought I was the only one. And because I'm doing that, and because I'm doing that, I don't listen to anything they're saying. Because I'm just telling myself to focus. Guys, I think I'm no. I, um, I think, I'm the, I think I'm the I might exact be same I, way. Guys, I might be off. I think I might be autistic. Really? What? Why? What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> oh, how are you doing? Great. great. Yeah. yeah good, good, good. Oh, actually, can I get another lemonade, please? Another lemonade? Okay. Yeah. Thank you very much. Oh, it's good. For real? I might be a robot, guys. Yeah. So. <laughs> oh, yeah. He <laughs> says oh, like, <laughs> the guy that waiter comes in like, oh, oh like, that's some deep ass shit. <laughs> like, did I come in at the wrong time? <laughs> no, I say that because. <laughs> I've noticed I can't stare anyone in the eyes while I'm talking to them. Me too. Wow. How could I, I have to like, I look away. The only way I can stare at someone in the eyes is, like, is with the girl and I'm like being like romantic with her. Yeah. You know, like, and, like if like, you know, we're like you're being biting, romantic. And you're biting your lip and shit. And biting my lip and I'm looking at you like this. Like, what's up? <laughs> That's the only way I can actually look someone in the yeah. eyes. But other than that, like if I'm having a conversation with you, but besides me being flirty or like romantic, I cannot fucking look in your eyes. I'm just like. No, yeah, same yeah, thing with me. I, yeah. can, I can hold. I can hold eye contact. See, well. I, can, yeah. I can pay I, attention when I'm not looking in their eyes. If I'm looking at their eyes, I start be like, "Fuck, I need to focus and shit like that." You know, I'm so you're good I at do, multitasking. That's, that's a good multi. I'm multitasking. terrible. I'm kind of terrible. It depends on what I'm doing. Fucking shit. I, I, yeah, I same. Can. It depends. I notice that sometimes I'm on the phone and if I'm playing Xbox, bro, I'm, I'm your own world. Like I'm trying to talk, but then sometimes they'll say something and then I'll be like, "Huh? What? What? You can't yeah? multitask? Shut up. All right. I, get, I care." <laughs> I could. I'm. I'm pretty good. At, well, sometimes the how how Aaron sounds it depends on what I'm doing. Yeah. When I'm good. Yeah. But like Thank sometimes you. I lose. I lose focus, bro. Especially when there's like a, like a female in the room. And she. Blew like 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 we're talking right now. Yeah yeah yeah. And then a girl will walk by and I'm just like. That's all of us. That's, That's all of us on command. Hell yeah. <laughs> now I've noticed <laughs> like when we do the uh, take the mic, I'll be reading like what they're saying, and I'm not even paying. A, I, I'm I'm just reading words, but I'm, nothing's. It's like I'm, autopilot. Yeah, I'm not taking anything in, so I don't know what the fuck I'm reading. I'm just reading words. Yeah. Were you an EOD? I was, for like. That's right. Hey, yo, shout out to EOD. Shout, shout out to EOD, 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 folks. Fuck these fools. We make fun of EOD. What the, EOD. I was an EOD. Right, let's go. What do you mean I was an EOD? I was an EOD. Yeah, bro. Hey, Hans, was the, Hans was the fool that was in it, but pretend like you never was. So making fun oh, he was <laughs> making fun of us. No, we still graduated. Huh? Bro, all through middle fool. school. EOD all day. All through middle school. God damn it. And high school. <laughs> And all, you're in it for that long? Oh yeah, bro. Because I, bro, I <laughs> all through that shit. What are you gonna do? All through that. I <laughs> start laughing in Jamaica. <laughs> all through that shit, fool. Yeah, I never had EOD. I, I, did, even, I, I, didn't, I, didn't, I didn't care, fool. I was like, this is easy, fool. I did it because I went to a racist school. I did it because, like, I mean, Spanish is my first language. I did because my mom like, put mom. Spanish in my first language yeah. in the thing, but then Same I took that shit. test and I passed it, so then I never, I never even went. You know what pissed me? You know what pisses me off about knowing two languages? My whole life, my mom was like. Oh, you're gonna get paid more when you know two languages. I've been to, I've had like 10 jobs. That's a requirement now. I've I've had 10 jobs. I've not been paid more because I know Spanish. That was back then. That was back then. That's when, you know, when it was like a, it was like all like the rush of like a lot of people coming in here. Uh So, like, if you knew two different languages, you're getting paid more. 
Latino. What people? Yeah. Latino. What do you mean? Latinos what do you mean? in general. What do you mean people? What do you mean the people? The immigrants, yeah. Goddamn immigrants coming over in this goddamn country. Who are you, Cesar Chavez or what? <laughs> <laughs> goddamn immigrants. Huh? You, you can't say that yet for your fucking immigrant yourself. Yeah, you're an immigrant too. What the fuck? For now. For now. Yeah. 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 Hey, 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 big question, bro. Your wife's going to hate me if I ask you this, but I'm going to ask you anyways. Oh, oh yeah, you don't leave your wife when you get your papers? Or? <laughs> That, Stop. that shit don't phase me, bro. Like, what? I'm with her because I love her. Been mm-hmm. together for years. If if I was a I was a motherfucker, I would have married her like 18 years old. We just got married. I'm 20. I'm 26. I got married 25. That was like fucking years. Don't Y'all motherfuckers right? know how it feels to not have papers. So. What are you doing? What are you so doing? Saying, it's, a, it's a difficult just, shit. Yeah. I said it's scary. For <laughs> that, yeah, yeah. No, but I'm telling you, bro. I know fools that graduated high school. They got married right after high school. I was always they, like, man, I'm gonna get married. They, were they in the military? I'm a, fuck, fuck, <laughs> the fuck, no. Okay. Well, I'm saying like, bro, I couldn't done that shit years back. Everyone's yeah. telling me, oh, get married, get married, get married. I was like, nah, it's, it's when I want to. Nah, you I feel love me? That. Is that something? That. Everything that was going on, bro, is like, even my parents, even friends, even other people, family, sister will tell me like, hey, yeah. like get your shit, get your shit, get married, get married. And I felt like we and her, we weren't, we weren't on the yeah, right connection right to get married. Not until later. I'm the one that fucking asked you to marry me. Well, yeah, because think about it. If you would have married her when you were younger, fool, like... We would have broken up to you. Well, not only that, but you guys would have been, like, been living with your her parents or your parents and have been uncomfortable for a lot of years. Would have been too, y- too young to get married and, like... What's going on over here, you fucking goofster? He's always people. doing something that makes me laugh. She was grabbing chicken <laughs> while I'm fucking talking about and marriage. I, and I was like, and my, my hands were just right here. So I was like, oh, wait, that's not... Let me not do that right here. <laughs> nails. Nah, but I do want to ask you a serious question. Like, do you like talking about that? Because I know. No, I don't trick. I know a lot of uh, I know a lot of DACA recipients don't like talking about it. Because I know yeah. a lot of people who are on DACA that I never knew they're on DACA until they told me, and it's something they don't like sharing. Nah, because to me it's like DACA to me is like a subscription to stay in this country. Mm-hmm. I know it sounds funny, but it's fucking lit. <laughs> hey, don't make fun of his that. struggles. I'm, I'm paid to stay here, bro. But I'm my, bro- to work my here. brother has no literally like, subscription you really, you really to stay have to pay? It's a subscription. It's fucking work here. That's oh, really shit. wow. So I'm not. I know people are kind of scared of not talking about it, but yeah, I don't care, bro. Like, what are they gonna do? Fucking call ice on me? Like, motherfucker, I gotta, I gotta fucking DACA, bro. Like, yeah, you yeah. can't do shit. You know, but I don't get laws. Well, I don't have no laws like you guys. Like, I can't smoke weed if I get like a lot really? of laws are like still bad for me. You feel me? Oh shit! They but just want, they just want to bring everyone down. It's bro. a process, bro. This I think right now is like what seven hundred thousand, eight hundred thousand kids DACA. Yeah. And they're still working on that shit, bro. A lot of, a lot of famous La people, a lot of influencers have La DACA. DACA. Fucking um, La DACA. David Dobrik? Da- Daisy Marquez. She oh, has DACA, bro. Who the fuck is Daisy Marquez? She's a famous Search her up. Instagram. He probably checked off to her already. <laughs> <laughs> it's just hard now, Bro, my mom's been trying to get her papers for the last 13 years. For real? When, they, when I hate when anyone who lives here that's white or whatever, if you're a citizen and you're not like from an immigrant family and you always ask like, well, why aren't you just getting your paper? Bro, it's hard. My mom's been trying for 14 years. What do you mean? My bro? brother, too. 14 through, years, yeah. bro. It's a long ass wait list. The government fucking. Sl- <sighs> my aunt took 22 years. <sighs> 22? 30 years, 40 <sighs> years. They don't fucking around there. Now, some immigrants that come here, <laughs> they don't get their papers because they, they fuck up the law. Yeah. So whenever they apply for their papers, they'll be like, oh shit, you got a DUI or you got a fucking ticket because of this or this and that. And that's gonna valen And then that's gonna valen madre, bro. Like they, sorry, I'm not Mexican. All the, the yeah. smallest things, bro, just to like not let you live here anymore, bro. It's stupid. That's why I've been hey, being good. You can't bro. sneeze in public. <clears throat> I've never got a DUI, never been arrested, never got stupid ass tickets, never want to go fuck around and shit. Cause my mom always said, bro, your friends are gonna go to jail. You're going to fucking boat. Like you're going back. Like, that's pretty deep. Day, you know that's what we call it. That's pretty deep. Like there, you're like, getting deported. You're gonna be on there. Let me drive the boat. <laughs> like bro, they're not taking me to jail. They're taking me straight to the yeah. fucking Honduras. Like yeah. I'm catching a flight the next day. Fuck. And y'all gonna sleep in jail the weekend and come out. For me, it's like I'm fucked. Yeah, that's, that's true. It's, we gotta be way more careful. Cause I, I guess like friends, they just be careless. Oh bro, let's do this. Yeah. But they have no idea like what their friend can go through. Hey man, once you have your papers, but we're look, going out, we're going wild out. But we're luckily going. we're not we're not crazy like that, bro. We have like our limits. Hey, hey, hey. Compared Dang. to other people, we are food. Nah, those people are pussies. We're though. not that we're not that one group of friends that just plays Monopoly on Friday nights. Okay, but those are just people <laughs> who like go to school their whole life and like they don't even get to enjoy their life. 
Just yeah. as soon as I out of high school, they went straight <clears throat> to school. That sucks, dude. I feel bad for people like that, bro. I don't. I mean, no, it's good I you're going to school, like you're doing you and you know being responsible. Because the faster bad. you get done with school, the fucking yeah. Because honestly, already, if you don't honestly, go to school, you don't you don't live your your young years. Yeah. What are your young years? Twenties. Your twenties, eighteen, nineteen. When you're in high school, exactly. Bro. People when usually graduate when they're twenty-four. This is your if they go out of high school, when you're someone who's trying to get your masters or you're fucking, you're trying to go. Well, it's better doing it. It's better doing it younger than getting your masters when you're like no, forty. That, no, that's totally right. But the thing is, you literally just waste your entire life Not on even. school. You're literally wasting your life on school. Or that's literally what it is. Or you're re- you're wasting the longer of your life on partying. And just if you focus on school first, then you can get that out the way. Then you have all the free time without that guilty conscience. And you gotta remember, you're a forty year old partying in the club when everyone's twenty. Nah, bro. You but graduate when you're like twenty four, twenty five. To become like a doctor, a lawyer, fuck nah. no, bro. Well, not everyone's yeah, gonna nah. be a doctor and a lawyer. If they're if they're a doctor That's and a lawyer, what we're talking about. No, you said masters earlier. But if you're gonna be a doctor and a lawyer, doctors, they don't even whatever, like partying. Doctor, whatever. I mean, I, I feel like this is the thing. Like, if you, this is the thing. Look. I feel like don't like you don't have to rush anything. That's that's what I'm trying to say. Like don't rush anything. Like have that plan in the back of your head and know what you're gonna do. And whenever you're ready, just do it. Bro, but y'all act like they don't party. Like exactly, no, bro. College kids party. Birthdays, they go to weddings. They no, go to a lot of them. I'm not don't, saying they bro. Don't. College kids go crazy. I'm not saying they don't. I say Depends some don't. Depends what college you go to. They still do when they got family. Yeah, bro. They got spring break. I had a dream last night. I had a dream. We were at Beyond, and I was so excited, and the speakers broke. And I was like, damn, so this is... This and then really, Rex stepped, stepped in, huh? And then Rex came in with <laughs> DJ Rex the ones and twos. Speaking of Rex, he has a show April 2nd. Y'all want to come out, support? Thank, thank you. you. Thank you. Man. You want to tell him? So April 2nd, I got a show called Desert Social Desert. And uh, I think like Palmdale. It is in the it's desert. It's over there, really in the desert. It's like a mini festival with like three stages. Like oh, dubstep wow. house. Oh shit. I think we're gonna I'm gonna go back to back with Jose. We're gonna do like um I think a whole hour and probably an hour and a half. <clears throat> it's just dope, bro, it's my first festival. I'm fucking excited. Nice. Let's do a fun question real quick. Out of That's everyone smooth. now of everyone in this <laughs> I thought this, you could take questions, Out of everyone in this table, who's gonna be the next one to get pregnant? The next one to get a girl pregnant? Hans. Why me? <laughs> Why me? Well, you fucked raw, food. I've been fucking raw since, I, since 18, Just food. like this raw shrimp? Since I was 18 years raw. old, food. All it takes is one time, bro. All it takes, bro. All it takes is that pre-cum, and that girl's literally, like, in our menstrual cycle. We don't want to bring the club out, food. Is that what it's called, menstrual cycle? cycle? It's just fake wood. Is that what she's... No, no, no. It's, oh, no. She's ovulating yeah. really hard, and... Yeah, I'm sorry, girls. I'm sorry. But, yeah, she, I mean, you never know. You're, you're going to fuck with the girl. She's ovulating, and you get that pre-cum, bro. Ooh, wee. I'm not it's having no fucking kids. Yeah. And if I do, I'm moving to Mexico. But what if you have it over there? I'm leaving the kid and going to Mexico. Once you're in they find him. <laughs> Bro, literally, I li- I've been lagging on so many girls for the past two months. <laughs> Me too. Like, it's just like, you know what's better than like going through like meeting up and like doing all the fucking smooth talk? Just fucking jerking off. No, cut I, so much. Save yeah, so much. Yeah, I know what you so mean. <laughs> Dodging all these girls. Yep. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> save so much time. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Oh, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Oh wow, we have to go think of our All right, guys. I'll see you guys at home. <laughs> <laughs> You're the one that you drove us here. <laughs> That's why I'm bouncy. But <laughs> <laughs> fuck you, bro. But you know what's crazy, bro? That's why. I, look, I'm gonna tell you guys something, fun. This is why I always like. When I, when, I, when I start talking to girls, I know it's gonna sound fucked up, but that's why I only have sex with them and then I leave. <laughs> because so when I start, well, no, no, it's cause look, it's cause about. when I when I have sex with them and I keep staying, I ca- I'm the one, I catch feelings quick. I know you guys might be like, what the fuck, that's weird. But bro, I'm the type where I'll talk to a girl for like three days and I'm already like, damn, I like her. <laughs> so that's why I always cut them uh, loose. No, I, exa- I cut them, I I cut exactly them, I cut what them loose. Means. I know exactly what you I, mean. I finish it before something even I know. starts. I think that's mm. one of my um, one of my downfalls. Your toxic traits. I, is that a toxic? Is that really toxic though? How is that toxic? You're toxic to yourself. To myself. To myself. Yes, yes. I feel like I I fall for girls way too easily. I feel like for me it's hard to get a girlfriend because oh. there's a I have a lot of attention on me and girls don't trust me. So I'm just gonna be I lonely. Think, I, I think you just don't trust yourself. Mm-hmm. I'm already taken. <laughs> fuck you guys. I'm happy. I feel like, happy, like, yeah, I'm like, yeah, I'm like yeah, I feel like these girls are willing to try with you, but you're not. You're not willing to try. Nah, it just depends. Single bitches. Y'all sleep at home at night. Uh, <laughs> 
That's another episode with I Am Foodies. Shout out to Aaron. 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 Thank you guys. Thank you. Um, make sure guys to pay next time. <laughs> make uh, sure to like, comment, <laughs> share, share, subscribe. Dude. Like, make sure to like, subscribe, share. Tell your grandma, your tío, your cuñados. Let us know uh, where we should go next and what we should try next. And we shall see you guys next week. And if you want papeles, hit us up. Hit us up. Yeah, hit them up. No, no, Y'all got papers. Peace. I don't have papers. Bye. <laughs>